Delray Beach man wanted for the murder of another man and seriously injuring his former wife is now in custody. Good evening. I'm Tiffany Kenny. And I'm Felicia Rodriguez. Thank you for joining us. U.S. Marshals tracked down Michael Friedman just one day after the early Wednesday morning violence inside a Winter Springs home launched that statewide manhunt. Investigators say Friedman was trying to kill himself in his car behind a restaurant in Citrus County when investigators caught up with him. Had hoses running from his exhaust into his vehicle. When they removed him from the vehicle, he was loopy. Um, but he has since been transported to the hospital, the local hospital, and been checked out and is going to be released. Terry Parker uncovered exclusive information Friedman's, in Friedman's Delray Beach neighborhood. Michael Friedman's father tells me that he did not know that his son had been captured, charged with killing his ex wife's boyfriend and stabbing her. And he says it's depressing. And some neighbors here tell me that there were some chilling clues. That everything was not all right. Did you have any expectation that he was so angry that he would go up and do anything? I'm not. I'm not angry. I'm. I'm depressed. Depressed. Joseph Friedman says he thought I was asking how he felt about his son Michael, who was just caught by police after they say he stabbed his ex-wife and killed her boyfriend. They did arrest him, huh? Yeah. Uh, you know something I didn't. Michael Friedman lived here in Delray Beach with his father since his 2013 divorce from his wife in Winter Springs. Neighbor John Zaza says they often heard Freeman at the pool having loud cell phone arguments with his ex. There were times when he, uh, he sounded very, very heated. You know, and the discussions were heated, and it sounds like a real domestic issues and, you know, talking about children. Zaza says he considered telling Freeman to keep it down, but didn't interfere. Did you expect that Michael was so angry at his ex wife that he would do anything like this? Don't ask me what went through his mind. He's a complicated man. A complicated man, he says, who neighbors say was friendly and who took care of his elderly father, but didn't tell that father about his apparent rage toward his ex-wife. No, I didn't want to get into conversation with him about that. Uh, it would upset him. Did Michael have a bad temper? No, who doesn't? <laughs> neighbors say Michael Friedman seemed like a good guy who took good care of his father. They call this all a very sad an unfortunate situation. In Delray Beach, Terry Parker, WPBF 25 News.